Hey kids, Colin here for Check It Out. You know, it may seem weird to have a whole day dedicated to this blood-sucking pest. However, World Mosquito Day has been recognized since 1897. That was when Sir Ronald Ross discovered the link between mosquitoes and that awful disease, malaria. And even though these pesky bugs can make us itch and twitch, let's put aside the heebie-jeebies to discover some fascinating facts about the mosquito. After all, it is their day. For instance, did you know there are 170 different species of mosquitoes in North America alone? Wow. Species like the Aedes or the Culex and the almost unpronounceable Anopheles. Almost like saying enough of these. The female though is the one that does all the blood sucking. She needs the protein in the blood in order to reproduce more mosquitoes. Now, to say you were bitten by a mosquito is wrong. That insect actually pierces the skin, then sucks up the blood with its long tongue. How does the mosquito find you, the food source? Well, it detects your body heat and the gas that you breathe out, and that's known as carbon dioxide. <laughs> Probably, as you know, mosquitoes like to attack you at night. That's when they're the busiest, and they will travel up to 14 miles to find your blood. The female likes to breed in stagnant water, sources like gross ponds, kiddie pools, and bird baths. Mosquitoes can go, and this is very interesting now, right from a little baby, the egg stage, to an adult in only 10, maybe 14 days. Now, how fast is that? But I think the most interesting fact about the mosquito, a 46 million year old mosquito that was found with a belly full of ancient blood. Researchers believe this female insect had a meal, then was blown by the wind into a lake and then sank. And she is preserved in a paper thin piece of shale. Now, isn't that cool? Wow! And who knew this insect was so fascinating? Well, we do now, don't we? So even if they make us itchy, the mosquito has fed us some cool facts. I'm Colin. Hey, check it out. Ouch! Pesky mosquitoes?